sexy Cat 6 cable over here. So hopefully that means we don't drop any more frames. God, this is a mess. God, this is a total mess. It's all right. We could retry it as many times as we have to in order to get to where we need to be. All right. Oh, God. Too loud. Too not. Too loud. Too not. All right. There. Okay. Let's start with the basics. All right. Now. There should be no game audio playing right now. Literally nothing I am streaming should be connected to game audio. So let's start with that, <laughs> okay? <laughs> we can get to the game as soon as we figure this shit out, all right? So there should be no game audio, right? Not a single bit of it. There is. There is audio playing. I don't understand how. How? Game audio is still on. How are you hearing game audio? My mic is plugged in, but there's nothing. I have the, the computer audio is muted. How do you even hear this? All right, all right. So that's the first problem we have to deal with. Okay, fair point. All right, thank you. All right, there is game audio playing. All right, all right, all right. Wait a second. Any game audio? Gone. All right, good. Okay. All right. We solved that hurdle. All right. Hurdle one cleared. Okay, cool. Now I can do this. All right. Now I can plug my microphone, I mean, I can plug my headphones into here. All right. So that was the first issue. It's still, what? All right. Oh my God, this is a mess. Oh, this is a mess all around. All right, I'm just gonna pull it up on my phone here to see what the hell I'm working with. Oh God. Don't worry, we'll get there at some point. We'll get there. Oh man, I gotta, I gotta get Bitcoin, man. Okay. There is audio. All right, there is audio. All right. I don't know how. Oh, this is perplexing. This is really weird. I don't know how there's game audio playing right now. This is so confusing. All right, well, whatever. I guess we could go ahead with it, I suppose. Um, is, is, it, is it all right compared to mine? Might be Bluetooth settings. Yeah, let's go. You know what? All right, let's go. Let's just do it. All right, Rowan, I don't have time for your crap. We've already wasted like 10 minutes just trying to get to this point. It's a Munchlax. All right. We live alongside Pokemon as friends. Sometimes they help us set up audio-visual equipment, but for the most part, we just have them beat the crap out of each other. Some people use their Pokémon to battle. It's very bully and entertaining. Check out my mustache. What do I do? I conduct, I conduct research on Pokémon. You should know the idea at this point. All right, choose you from the lineup. We're just gonna go basic here. All right, what's my name? Um. All right, so let's see. 
teching some variation thereof when we played uh, Gen 6. No, Gen 7. When we played Gen 7, I was uh, teking because tiki, because Hawaii, um, because of the Eloan region. Um, I can't remember what I named myself. I think I just named myself Sir Techington in uh, Galar. Um, but yeah, considering this is a remake, see, here's the thing. I've never really played a Gen 7, I mean, Gen 4 game. Not really. Um, I guess I could just go standard here. We've wasted enough time. Let's just go. We've wasted enough time. Yes, I am teching. A fine name that is, sir. Capital! Now, this boy here, I believe he's your friend. He has very interesting hairstyle, but, you know, that's what the kids these days are rocking. All right, um, well, because of the situation, let me tell, well, I'll tell you my rival's name. All right, so because Roger picked my name as uh, his rival, I got to go with him. Actually, you know what? Instead of that, can we go with Roger's base as the full name does? Roger, um, is it a capital B or is it just, is that the right way it's spelled? I don't want to mess it up there. Yeah, did you know Roger's base named his rival after you? Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's the reason why he went... I, I, I was kind of like a split on which one I was going to buy first, um, Pearl or Diamond. And I saw him playing Diamond, and he named me after that. So I'm like, all right. Oh, it's a capital B. All right, all right. I don't want to mess it up. I don't want to mess it up, man. I'm not going to, you know, throw his name in the lower case. All right. That's it. That's right. That looks right, right? Yeah, it's the capital B, Matt. Don't forget. All right. Capital B. All right. We good? Is that set? All right, cool. Roger's base, is it? That's your friend's name. Yes. All right, Teching, the time has come. Fetch your own sweater vest and take on this Pokemon journey and discover love and happiness. Uh, whatever, it's four o'clock. It's time for my nap. Have fun, young man. All right, great. We wasted so much time. We just got to go. Somehow there's audio, even though I have the audio turned off in the game, I don't understand it. Despite the exploration team's best efforts, the rare, oddly colored Pokémon eluded detection. The rumored Red Gyarados failed to appear, even fleeting, to the crestfallen team. Is that a news report or is that a documentary? The, the wording seemed a little bit too dramatic for a, uh, like a nightly news report, you know? I guess it was a special news report. Man, the, uh, the Pokémon news network is very dramatic. All right, I'm a bobble-headed guy. Look at me, guys. <laughs> I don't know why this is so entertaining. Can I run yet? All right, let me just get the hang handle on everything here. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm like a freaking pop figurine in this. This is great. Oh my god, oh my god I'm checking my shoes. Like, just hanging out. I love the scarf. I love that I'm rocking the scarf. You just, oh, my knee's a little itchy. Gonna, gonna scuff some dirt off my pants. Oh, that's great. Okay, do I got anything in my PC? A potion or perhaps a berry? No. I wanna play the Switch. I wanna play Breath of the Wild. When's Breath of the Wild 2 coming out, guys? Come on. The X button opens up the menu. That's great. That bed does not look like the appropriate size, even for me. That that looks like that that pillow should be twice the size, given the head size of my head. Random question: How many pillows do you guys sleep with? Because I sleep with six. I need six pillows on my bed for proper comfort. One pillow is just not going to cut the mustard. Roger Space came calling for you a little while ago. This is like a this is like a parallel dimension where all the anime One Piece YouTubers all live in the same neighborhood together. <laughs> Roger Space came to visit, you know, and Joy Boy wants to hang out at his place tonight. Will you all go together? <laughs> Two, four, five, one, three. Yeah, see anybody that could sleep comfortably with just one pillow. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't. I just don't think you and I are ever gonna see eye to eye on that one. Six pillows? Why? It's like, well, it's comfortable. Where I could wake up in the middle of the night and I could just grab a pillow. You know, it's nice. I don't know what it was all about, but he said it was an emergency. 
A YouTube emergency! They removed the dislike bar teching, whatever shall we do? Mom's favorite dessert is in the fridge. Well, if that was my mom, that would be peanut butter fudge. Because my mom makes peanut butter. She makes fudge like no other person. She has like 200 damn first place ribbons from 15 years. She's went to the uh, Pennsylvania State Farm Show. She loves peanut butter fudge. Uh, ironically, she doesn't like peanut butter. Those are delicious cooking. Nice island here. Oh, it's a cookie! Can I have some cookie? Can I have a cookie? Give me, can I take a cookie for my journey? I can feed my Pokemon sugar. That'll heal them. Wow, this is a really shiny house. Oh, wow. Wait, 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 the floor is spick and span. It is very shiny. Alright. What is she watching? What are we watching? The, the Chansey Playoffs? <laughs> the Contest Digest. Alright. So, guys, what, uh, what Pokemon do you think I'm gonna pick, huh? Oh, yes, Techie. Don't go into the tall grass. Wild Pokemon might attack you. It'll be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't, so stay the hell out of the grass! So, are, like, anybody that doesn't have a Pokemon in this world just stuck in their own hometown, never allowed to leave without, like, some kind of Pokemon support? You know? Oh, wow, this is actually... See, I don't really know much about Sinnoh, because I never played Gen 4 growing up, and I only played a little bit of, uh, Platinum. I tried to do a Let's Play of Platinum, but that was years and years ago. I think it was like 2015, 2016 I tried to do that, and I never finished it, I recall. Um, but I don't remember a lot of it, and so this Pokemon games were just never... This is when I stopped playing Pokemon when I was a kid. I played Gen 3, skipped over Gen 4 completely, uh, and then when Gen 5 happened, I started getting back into it there. Well, actually, no, wait. When Heart Gold and Soul Silver came out, was that Gen 5 or Gen 4? That was Gen 5, wasn't it? Anyway, I, I didn't play, you know, Gold... Uh, I played Ruby Sapphire, didn't play Diamond and Pearl, and then I started playing Heart Gold and Soul Silver. That's when I got back into Pokemon. That was Gen 4, okay. Well, that's crazy. That's crazy to think that in Gen 4, we had a reboot of Gen 2, and now Gen 8 is a reboot of Gen 4. Oh, look, I'm stretching. Like, ah, this is a nice day out here. Technology just blows me away. Now you can play with people around the world. Wirelessly! This guy's mind is blown. Tekking's house? Okay. About in here, I'm just gonna walk into random people's houses, as is standard for most Pokemon games. Hello there! I can't see! He was gone for four years! Listen, listen! I want a cute Pokemon! Well, I'm not getting a cute Pokemon. I'm gonna get a Pokemon that's like super powerful. He's gonna like breathe fire and laser beams and he's gonna have like like circular saws for hands and he can fly with like a jet pack he's gonna be like the most badass pokemon like ever and he could like digivolve into like every other pokemon oh god thud oh hey teching i'm going to the lake you should come too and be quick about it who talks like that I'm finding you one million if you're late. Oh no! Is Roger's base part of the mob in this? Oh jeez, I forgot something. Okay, well, you're uh, as with as with most rivals in the Pokemon game, you're very energetic. All right. Yeah, and the reason Roger named his rival Teching is because his original default name is Barry. So in which case. Eh, Barry's over here. Barry's over here hanging out behind his two balls. Yeah. Wow. Barry's mom looks, looks pretty stoned in this. She's just like, Whoa, dude. You got, like, a bobblehead. We all have, like, bobbleheads, dude. Oh, hey, Teching. We're going to the lake. I'll be waiting on the road. It's a 10 million poke dollar fine if you're late. Okay, bye. 10 million yen? That's like five dollars! Seriously, what is your story? The kid rocketed off again like usual. I guess he'll be out on Route 201? I can't handle that kid. He is way too hyper. I gotta get blazed, man. 420. Alright. Bobbleheads! Alright, here we go. I guess we just go. We just go for it.
Hey, you saw the news reports. That was on TV, right? You know, search for the Greg Gyarados and all. There was only one television station, so you had to have been watching it. Okay, we're gonna go find a Pokemon like that. Great, awesome. Mom is so out of it. You actually have to pay. She actually charges He actually charges you the 10 million yen. I'm tired of listening. I make my own destiny, Roger. Barry. Want an Elekid? Eh. An Electivire would be cool. A million yen is like $10,000. Yeah. Usually I just subtract two zeros from the yen, and that usually gives you a ballpark estimate for this. We're not old enough to go through the tall grass, but we can take on a red Gyarados, sure. Oh, this is a nice little scene. Men may be mistaken. Something appears to be different than the last time I was here before. Don will leave him. Professor, how are you enjoying being back in Sinnoh after being away for four years? It must be exciting again. I should just give Don, like, a really annoying voice. But I won't. For one thing, I just don't have the... I, I, I don't have the consistency to keep that up. I beg your pardon. We'll be on my way now. I'll, I'll try to give her a British accent, but I suck at British accents, so it's gonna... It's gonna fail. Alright, cool. Do I get my Pokemon now? No, no problem! No problem! We'll be in and out there long enough, blah, blah, blah. I mean, you couldn't go into the other tall grass, but this tall grass, no problem. Man, that guy's senile. Just left his briefcase hanging out in the grass. Damn. Ah, uh, here we go! Attacked by... GENERIC BIRD POKEMON! No! Quick! Take the belt! <laughs> Alright, um, this Pokemon is named, uh, Starling, right? I don't know my Gen 4 Pokemon that well, guys. Alright, we got those balls. Alright. Huh. Okay. Let's just see who's who. We got Turtwig. We got Char. And we got Hiplup, right? Alright, at least I knew that much. Okay. So, right here, in my hand, I have myself a D10. So, I'm going to roll this D10. I'm going to leave it up to the fates, okay? If it lands on a 1, 2, or 3, we'll get Turtwig. If it lands on a 4, 5, or 6, we're going with Chimchar. 7, 8, 9, we're going to be with Piplup. And if we get a 0, we'll just re-roll. All right. Are you guys ready? Let's do this. Rolling the dice. Move this over here. The fates will decide! Oh, shit! It landed on a 0! All right. That means we get a shiny Rayquaza. That means we get a shiny Arceus with all the plates. Awesome. All right, let's try this again. All right. Are you guys ready for this? All right, here we go. It landed on a one. So that means we are a Turtwig family, damn it. No, Turtwig. We're going with Turtwig. Although I do like that the default's on no, so you don't accidentally pick the wrong one. All right, Turtwig gang, let's go! And just like that, two-thirds of the chat live left in rage. But the last third is like, all right, Tekking, you know where it's at. You know what? I actually like Torterra. Aw, oh, shit, guys! He knows withdraw at first level. That's like the strongest move ever. Withdraw, Turtwig! Withdraw into your clam shell that you just inexplicably have for some reason. Oh, Starly. You can't do anything to this body, Starly. I can withdraw all day. Alright, everybody, this isn't really a Nuzlocke, but start working on nicknames for a Turtwig. I'll leave this more or less up to you this time around. Once more! Take out the bird! 
All right. Yay! Pop Green is a good one. I like that. Pop Green, Donatello, uh, Zunisha, Peckham, Peckoms because he has the turtle fruit. Yeah. Oh, oh, you think your Chimchar is better? So wait, 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 wait. So, in the first game, you get the Pokemon from Professor Oak like normal. In the second game, uh, it's stolen from the lab, uh, Professor Elm, and you have to take the other Pokemon in order to defeat Silver. In the third game, you save Professor Birch by using a Pokemon to get that Poochiena off of his tail, right? Okay, so in this one, you just straight up steal the Pokemon. I love that. You just, like, you find a, a briefcase in the middle of the woods, you're like, alright, let's just take this dude's Pokemon. Alright, cool. Now, I'm sure he'll be like, you kids can have the Pokemans. I'm sure that's how it's gonna go, but that's pretty funny. <laughs> just name it Weed. Basically, yeah. This is no good! Yeah, and take that Piplup with ya. Nobody wants the Piplup, Dawn. You can have it, I suppose. What's... Um... Oh, okay. I don't know what's going on, Teching. Let's get out of here. My Pokemon got hurt from that battle. Yeah, because you're weak, Barry. Roger. Ugh. Now, see, here's the problem. If, if this uh, rival does anything to annoy me... I don't want to say, like, that sucks, Roger Base, because then it'll make it sound like I'm saying that to Roger. So, when I like what he's doing, I'll call him Roger Base. When I don't like what he's doing, or if his if his demeanor annoys me, I'll call him Barry. Although, I'm still gonna get killed for that one because of Barry. Oh, thanks for the $50 super chat. Yeah, I might not be able to read the super chats as much in this one, but thanks everybody for that, big time. I have a name. I have a name, I have a plan. I kind of want to name him. It doesn't really relate back to a turtle, but yeah. Soggy boy. I... Hmm. I'm not really a huge fan of that. Call the Turtwig Woody. Well, you know, I did watch Toy Story the other day. Well, I suppose that's how it is then. All right, well, I guess you just got some free Pokemans out of it. Well, I mean, I guess it's okay. So we got some free Pokemon. Great. See, I feel like Soggy King would make more sense if it was Piplup, because Piplup is, like, the water type, so he actually is Soggy. You know what I mean? Just call it Frankie. Yeah, that'll be my default. Moss Head. I won't be able to reach much Super Chat. Then you drop a $50 Super Chat. Yeah, well, I caught that one. I don't know if there was any before that. I can't believe that happened to you. So you mean to tell me you stole a turtle and then beat up a defenseless bird? You're growing up, son. Terror Ain. Ooh, I like that. That's edgy. That's an edgy kind of name that you would come up with. Like, Terror Ain. Okay. All right. Sakanade 6. I think we're going to go with Terror Ain. That's a good one. Maybe we should make all our Pokemon sound like the edgiest, like, not goth, but like, you know, maybe, okay, maybe goth in some cases. Is Litwick in this? Oh, it's now he's Gen 5. Shit. What are our ghost Pokemon options in this? Oh, we can catch Rotom! We get a Rotom, right? Rotom's in this. Alright. Isn't that just nifty? Just name him Death. All right, can we run now? I think we got the shoes in that exchange. There we go! Oh, yeah, kicking up some dust. You pop the clutch and tell the world to eat my dust. All right, I have no idea where I'm going. So I'm going to go over here first. Tortellini!
Does he have anything I can take? <laughs> Alright. Oh, man. Terror Ain or Tortellini? Because that's, that's a Spongebob reference. Alright. Alright, here we go! What do we got? Bidoof! Bidoof, destroyer of worlds and galaxies. Alright. I think we made the right move. You know, you don't usually go with grass types too often. Spirit Tomb's in this. Oh, so oh, yeah, he is. I've never had a Spirit Tomb. So many Gen 4 Pokemon I've always, um, glossed over just because I never played the game when I was uh, growing up. Defeat the Bidoof. Oh, yeah, I got a crit. That's how it's done. Yay! Spirit Tomb's hard to get. Well, I don't have any... I don't think I have any Pokeballs. By the way, uh, is the sound okay? We just kind of, like... I never really adjusted the sound settings. I just kind of rolled with it. And I still don't know how the settings are even working right now. But if everything's good, I mean, everything's good. Man of Culture. Catch an Ella Kid! Thanks, Gaming Wolf. Sound is good. Give nicknames. Oh, cool. Oh, there's actually a setting to turn it off. That's cool. What the hell's a gyroscope? Oh, okay. Oh, I can't, I can't adjust the audio, though. Okay. Big fan of you for years. Thank you. What's your story, lady? Okay. So, common knowledge, then. Alright, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go. Oh, hey, Dawn, what's up? Sand Gem Town. I wonder if they have any sand or gems. Alright. Okay. Thud. You gotta stop just running into me there, Barry. Roger. Barry Roger. Roger Barry. Is Toxic Rook in this? Uh, he might be. I don't remember. No, I think he's Gen 5. Bully! So you've come ticking! Was it, uh, let me see that Pokémon again. Mm, yes, well, you've had this Pokémon for ten minutes, and it seems rather happy enough. Yes, I suppose I could just give it to you as a gift. Alright. Uh, let's see how this sounds. I'm gonna have the edgiest team of Pokémon in all of Sinnoh. terror Ain, Like, Terrain, but terror Ain. Alright. I like that. I like that. Terrain. Yeah. Name the Turkwig Pop Green. That's another one that's pretty good. Toxicroak is Gen 4. Alright, well, shows what I... Oh, by the way, for those of you that have never watched me play a Pokemon game before, very important piece of information for you to know right at the gate. I don't know shit about Pokemon. I mean, I, I feel like I should know about Pokemon, but I don't. So, I'm gonna mess up a lot of times. Alright? <laughs> Maybe two R's would make it look better. Yeah. Let's try that with two R's. Terror Ain. Eh. I like it this way. I think this works. Alright. I don't know, but Pop Green is really good too. Man, can I do a pull? Oh, I can do a pull. Great, great, great. I could do a pull here. Awesome. Alright. Because I, I do like Pop Green. Pop Green is, is a very cutesy name. Alright. See how this goes. Put more than two names. Alright, fine. Hold on. Let me do another one. Alright. Hold on, I'm restarting it. Alright, let's see here. Okay, we got Terrain. If this is the pace we're going at, I might get done with this game in, like, uh, I don't know, March? Maybe April? Uh, let's see. Pop Green was another one. I saw Bonsai. 
like a bonsai tree. Gaimon, Green Bull. I'm seeing a lot of Green Bulls because One Piece. All right, here we go. We got three. Got three names here. Okay, here we go. We got Terra Rain. We got Bonsai. We got um, Pop Green, Bonsai, and Green Bull. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Tortilla. I re I really don't like Tortilla. That doesn't really that doesn't really work for me. Pop Green's got 46. It's currently winning. Oh, uh, looks like Pop Green's gonna be the far above winner here. You know what? That's okay. Pop Green is a cute name. Let's go with that. We can still name the other way. We could get another Pokemon for the edge. Don't worry. I like Pop Green, though. Alright. Go with Pop Green here. Alright. Pop Green. There we are. Thanks, guys. Alright. Yes. Your friend Roger's base told me what happened at the lake. I heard you battled very well, despite it being your first time. And from what that I can see, my accent is changing as well. That's why I would like you to entrust you to this Turtwig. I'm glad you're kind toward Pokemon. Oh, I'm Dawn now. I, it's like, if you want, I'd have to... Oh, I just can't say it. She'd have to just, you know, she'd have to, you know, take out a baseball bat and just go to town, I guess. She would have had to come rescue us, I suppose. Don't mess with Dawn. She's like a black belt in karate. If only Turtwig could learn smokescreen. Maybe. Just maybe. I actually have no idea. I have no reference point for a lot of these Pokemon. So we're just going to have to go off on a wing and a prayer here. Okay, the countless Pokemon in the world. Yeah, there's... How many are we up to? How many Pokemon are we up to now? Like, 900-something? We gotta be getting close to 1,000 soon. She's a black belt and in baseball batting. Absolutely. Eight hundred ninety-six. Eight hundred ninety-nine. And we're getting there. wonder what the thousandth Pokemon will be. I wonder. All right. Uh, are you going to give me anything? Oh, you're Dawn's dad! All right, that's nice. That's cool. Yeah, are you going to give me anything? All right, great. Your glasses look silly. I'll act as your mentor. I've got a bit more experience than you. I traveled with this guy named Ash. And, you know, he was... Well, he tried his best. So I can help you. Da-da-da-da-da! Okay. That's not red. That looks more orange to me. I'm discovering I might be colorblind when it comes to differentiating between orange and red. Because a lot of times they look the same to me. Alright, that's definitely blue. Can I go and catch Rayquaza now? I'm sorry, can I go catch God now, please? Where is the flat cap? I, I don't know. Somewhere. I don't know what that is. Oh, Dawn, you're so reckless. Okay, what was I supposed to do? Oh my god. Uh, it's just all these little trivial things in the beginning of every Pokemon game that always... I always wish they just install a feature where you can just uh, skip tutorial shit, you know? Like, just like, have you played a Pokemon game before? Yes or no? Yes. Okay, cool. You just start... Here's your starter. Here's some Pokeballs. Have fun. You know the drill. You know, if there's anything different, we'll tell you. Alright, I gotta go tell Mom that I'm going on an adventure by myself across the country. Alright, Mom, I'm going on a Pokemon journey. Love you, bye! No, I'm not doing a Nuzlocke. Yeah, I'd like that. Yeah, that would be so convenient, right? Alright, yep, that's great. You stay here and just watch your soap operas, Mom. Thanks for the guidebook. Cool, great. Man, all these ad all these adults and not a single one of them have given me a single potion or any kind of food for my journey. Just, just like, here's a Pokemon and a guidebook. Have fun, son. 
Oh, dude! Uh, is Roger's base here? No, he's not. He must have left already. Oh, that boy shouted about going on an adventure, and he bolted. Uh... <laughs> she is so out of it. She's either really high, or she's just really just... She's had a long day. It's hard being that... It's hard being Barry's mom. Parcel. Great. Alright, where am I delivering the parcel to? Oh, probably your son. Yeah, okay. Alright, we good? We good? Oh, I've done the Pokemon randomizers before. There we go! We got the cap! The, the, the Pokemon drive... I always thought it just looked like a driving cap. Like, you ever see, like, a driving cap like old people wear? Yeah, that's what I always reminded me of. Okay. Are we good? Are we good? Guy with overalls. I know we've had a long storied history together, so you, you, you rock on, man. You have fun. And, uh, have I been in this house yet? I don't think I went in this house. Oh, oh, dude, this is the coolest guy in town! Which, like, out of, like, eight people, but still. I went on an adventure with some Pokemon a long time ago. Don't mean to brag, but, uh, yeah, I became the Pokemon master. I found Red and I kicked his ass. Yeah. He had a level 81 Pikachu. I had a level, like, a million, uh, Poliwag, so how about that? Alright, do I have any- do I have any Pokeballs here? Anybody give me any Pokeballs yet? Nope. Couldn't even give me a single Pokeball. Man. Alright. Alright, how much money do we got? Oh yeah, Cynthia's in this game. I'll just go- I'll just go on record now. Cynthia's like the best Pokemon waifu that ever did it. Well, maybe Lorelei. Lorelei. I don't know. Okay. We got 8,000 doll hairs. Alright. Eh, give me 10. Okay. This is good. I think they start you off with more money here. Uh, give me three potions. Give me an antidote just in case any bullshit happens. Actually, give me two. Is this the game where, um, poisoning still happens out of battle? I feel like Gen 4, I feel like it, it does. I think Gen 5 is when they change that. Cynthia is the queen. Gotta love her, even if she's terrifying. Damn straight. Yeah, Cynthia is pretty number one, yeah. Alright. I'm here to sell some things. Alright, do come again. Alright, it was a rough start. We had a rough start getting here, but we're here and that's all that matters. Alright. Now, let's go catch some Pokemon! Damn it! <laughs> okay. Oh my god, I know how to do this! I am 28 years old! I've been playing these games since I was 8! Oh god, that makes me feel old. Give up! I mean, Piplup, Empoleon is pretty damn sweet. I mean, I, I do regret it a little bit, but we're with Turtwig now. We're with Pop Green. So anybody that's made it all the way to Cynthia at this point, um, is she, would you say, harder or easier to face than in the original game? We were so close! Hey, I didn't say I was mature. I just said I was 28. When it comes to Pokemon, I know how to catch a damn Mon, okay? She's hard. Holy shit. She's way harder. She is impossible. Like, okay, well, looks like we're just gonna have to assemble the greatest crack team of Pokemon that ever did Pokemon. I'm talking an all-star lineup. We're gonna get a, uh... We're gonna get our Pop Green evolved into a Torterra for one. And then we're gonna get ourselves the badass, the most badass psychic Pokemon that ever existed that's also a waifu. So we're gonna get a Gardevoir. Uh, actually we could get a, um... Ah, crap. What's the, uh, male equivalent of a Gardevoir? Eh, whatever. We're gonna get one of those. And, um... Let's see, electric type. We're gonna get one of those, uh, cat things. The cat sphinx thing. The, you know, you know what I mean. That thing. Luxray. We're gonna get one of those. Uh, 
As for water Pokemon, we're gonna get a, um, we're gonna get a, what's a really badass Gen 4 Pokemon here? Uh, water Pokemon. I, I don't know, but we're gonna get a cool one, and it's gonna know Hydro Pump, and it's gonna hit, like, every single time. Alright? Delayed. Yeah, we're gonna get one of those, yeah. We're gonna get a, uh, the, one of those things that Cynthia has that's really terrifying, the shark thing, the land shark. We're, we're gonna get that. Yeah, we're gonna get everything. Alright, now can I catch some damn Pokemon? Alright, you know what? Fine. Sounds like a special report for the news. This just in, Youngster Joey's gonna kick your ass! Not Youngster Joey, Youngster Tristan. But the Yu-Gi-Oh! reference still works anyway, and that was completely unplanned. Alright, Pop Green, let's go! Tackle! Tackle until your freaking skull cracks! Ah! Yeah! Go! Crobat. Ooh, Crobat would be fun. But this is Gen 4. I will institute a single rule. We catch only Gen 4 Pokemon. Okay, that's a stupid rule, and I'm gonna stop right there. Ooh, Obama Snow's in this too. That's a good one to catch. Gotta get that. I love the battle theme. This is probably the single... I did know this. I did know the battle theme from Gen 4, and it's my favorite one. Just generic battle theme. And it's gonna get really epic here in a second, so I'm gonna shut up here. Come on. Come on, here we go. Here we go. Love it! Level 6! Do we get Razor Leaf? Leafage? What the hell is Leafage? We can leave him! Make like a tree and get out of here. Alright, youngster Tristan. I don't know about what I did. Alright, here we go. I spy with my little eye a trainer! It just always throws me out we are all bobbleheads in this universe, but okay. All right, oh my god, she has access to God! It's all right. It's a one-horse town. All right, I gotta try Leafage here. All right. Ugh. All right, what's this just do here? All right, the user attacks by belting the target with leaves. That sounds... Extraordinarily threatening. This is a kid's game, Nintendo! Alright, fuck it. Throw the leaves! Oh, okay. Alright. So, don't mess with Pop Green. Pop Green just goes over, picks up some leaves, and just. Ugh! One shot kill. Alright, here we go. Level 7, nice. Oh no, she's got another one! Two Bidoofs! Leafage! God, this makes me pumped. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. There we go. All right. Stab with the leaves. Oh, boo. I can't win. Not with that attitude. Hey, you're lucky. You have Bidoofs. I have zero Bidoofs. Pop Green just killed God. Youngster Logan. Oh God, it's Wolverine. There we go. Yeah, Shinx. We gotta get one of those. Put that on the shopping list, ladies and gentlemen. We gotta get a Shinx. Oh no, it's intimidating. It's so intimidating. Let's try to stab it. Let's stab the Shinx. Oh, I get it. Because of Lynx. Because of Cat. I get it. Oh, yeah. There we go. You can leer at me all you want. Good shot with the tackle. There we go. 
you can get Shinx on this route. We haven't encountered any Pokemon yet on this route. <gasps> like, wow, totally! I'm gonna go join the X-Men! Alright. Oh, wow, we made it through that whole route and didn't encounter anything. Well, I'm not done yet. Hey, you want to battle? Oh, okay. Got a potion, nice. Man, the Pokemon around here just know I'm too badass. They won't even touch me. Wow, look at that. Wow. There we go. All right. Come on, Shinx. No. Well, actually, you know what? All right. Just because of the meme, I will catch the Badoof. We're not doing a Nuzlocke. We're just gonna, just gonna play the game. Just gonna play the game. Oh, this is probably gonna kill it. This is probably gonna kill it. Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. All right. Badoof, you have proven yourself worthy of joining my team, of becoming one with my squad. I think that I think that lady at the market uh, shortchanged me because I think I'm supposed to get one premier ball for every ten pokeballs, and she only gave me one. I'm gonna go back in there like a Karen. I demand my second premier ball, ma'am. All right, we caught a Badoof. Great, awesome. He will mostly be used to cut down trees and headbutt things, but I can give him a name. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Alright. That just reminds me of, um, uh, I've been re-watching a lot of Key and Peele's stuff this past week, and that just reminds me of the, uh, the, the, the Super Bowl, like, you know, the, the funny football team names and stuff, and it's just, God! <laughs> God has been added. Somewhere Arceus is just like, what? Alright, I get a Shinx. Oh, it is so freeing to not worry about Nuzlocke, though, because I always do Nuzlocke. I'm so happy just to play a game. There we go! Alright, start thinking of badass names for an electric cat. Alright, here we go. Here we go! If you can't survive one leafage, I don't want you on my team. You know what? You deserve it. You deserve the premier ball, Shinx. I kind of just want to name him Shanks. Because he's Shinx, you know? There we go! Dark Thunder. And, oh, oh, nice! Pop Green grew to level 8, and, uh, God still level 2. Alright, uh, male or female? Oh, it's a female Shinx. Okay, uh, what name is a good name for a female Shinx. Yoroichi! You know what? I normally don't like to name my Pokémon after anime characters, but you know what? Because I normally don't like to do it... Screw it! Let's do it! <laughs> I haven't played a Pokémon game in so long. And Bleach is coming back next year. It's been a while since I thought about Bleach. Yeah, let's go Yoroichi. Why not? Ooh, Electra though. Electra's a good name. Respect Pedro. Thunder Tempo. Pedro. Yoroichi is such a cute name. Yeah, whatever. We're going with Yoroichi. Wait, actually, no. Oh, okay. I wasn't gonna change it. I was gonna see if I could add a little lightning bolt symbol. Did it? Do they have those in this game? I mean, there's the name raider. At some point, we could change names anyway. But do they have like little symbols you could add after? That'd be cool. Jubilee City. Okay. Cool. You catching Pokemon? Yes, I'm, I'm doing fine, Dawn! I don't need you to dote over me. I got it, alright? I caught God at a freaking electric cat. I'm good. You can use stickers. Alright. Hi, Nurse Joy. You're looking kind of creepy as always. Let's do this. Call me a purist, but I liked it when the Pokemon and um, the Pokemon Center and the Mart were like separate buildings. Not everything needs to be streamlined, Game Freak. Wait, what was that guy wearing? Is that guy wearing glasses or like a mask? Oh, it's just glasses. From this side, it looked like he was wearing like a CP, like a like a freaking uh, Cypher Pool Zero mask or something. S someone's salty about Don. Look, look, like. When it comes to the rivals in this game, I'm sure they're fine, you know? It's just like, 
you just want to get into the game. I want to catch my Pokemon. I want to train them up. I want to beat gym leaders. You know, I'll fight. I'll fight the uh, the rivals along the way. A clown man. Oh dear me, what have I got myself into? I know it's a little sudden, but would you like to join a group? Well, this is moving too fast. Uh, I mean, like, you, you can collaborate. Alright, if, if you just walk up to some random dude with green hair on the street and he's like, you want to join my group? Eh, probably should maybe keep moving. Hey there, hey there, kids! You should probably stick around! We're doing a poke, poke, poke campaign soon! Before it starts, I think you should run shop at the trainer school there! Okay, I'm gonna stay away from you, freaky clown man. No, oh, where'd you come from? Okay, cool. Oh yeah, it's a huge city. Anything cool to catch in here? I can get a propeller in here? He might be asking you to be his Nakama. Oh, we got a heal ball. Alright, why not? I think the catch rate is the same as regular Pokeballs, but it heals you. Eh, diversify. It's Buggy D. Clown here in Pokemon Land. Shelves are jammed with colorful Pokemon goods. Gotta collect them all. Okay, so do you think there is collectible Pokemon merchandise in the Pokemon universe? And the tagline for said merchandise in the Pokemon universe is gotta catch them all. I'm assuming there would be. Alright, is this the school, I'm guessing? Yeah. Uh, do we have to go to school? Damn it! <laughs> um, well that's great, because I'm not going in the building, I'm just gonna walk in front of it. Lady, I swear to god! Alright. Hey, old man. Do you know much about Pokemon? Yes. Oh, okay then. Well, you don't need me then. Like, Alright, cool. So I like that guy. I like this guy. He gets it. He gets it. Treating me like an adult here. I'm assuming he won't let me leave. <laughs> so imagine like you're walking through a city and you're like, alright, I'm gonna leave now. And the guy stops you and he's like, have you seen the supermarket? I'm like, nah. He's like, you gotta see the supermarket or else I can't let you leave. I'm like... There we go. Tekking is the American version of Ash Ketchum. You are not wrong. Yeah, I figured I had to go to the school, but, you know, get some battling in in the meantime. Oh, nice. Defense curl. Wow. That was way more epic than it really probably was in real life. Like, the Bidoof in real life would have probably just, like, scrunched up, like, you know, like that, like, in a, in a fetal position. Here, it's like a magical barrier. Love the effects, though. You could defend yourself all you want to, Bidoof. Leapage! There we go. Yeah, this will be saved on YouTube. There it goes! Level 4! Alright, yeah. Oh, nice! Yoroichi learned Thundershock. The most epic of all... Are the animations for all of the lasses like they're almost about to cry every time I beat them? Because that's kind of sad. This just in, the weather report calls for a, a, a partly cloudy with a chance of Bidoof. Bring it on, Tyler. Tyler was uh, the name of uh, a friend I had when I was a kid, and he had... His dad was, like, a construction worker, and he had the coolest treehouse in, like, the entire town. Like, they had a shed in his backyard, and his dad built him a treehouse... Not a treehouse, but built him a room on top of the shed. And it was so cool, because it had, like, a trap door. You had to go up a, a step ladder to get there. It had a trap door. It had cable running out there. It had power in there. It had a bed. God, that was such a nice treehouse. Anyway, Magikarp, huh? Look at 
Look out, Tekking! It's generic boy trainer! I should use Shinx for this. I should use Yoruichi here. Bam! I'm assuming he has another Magikarp after this, so we'll switch out. Even a battle with a Magikarp and the music is epic as hell. You've defeated my Magikarp. However, I have another Pokemon that you will face now. Uh, when does uh, Turtwig uh, evolve, guys? Oh, that works too. That works too. Alright, here we go, Yoroichi. Level 16, huh? I'm getting 16s and 18s. Ow! Oh! Thunder Shock! Paralyzed, paralyzed, paralyzed. Shit. Come on, Yoroichi! You can do it! I believe in you! There it goes. It's 18. Alright, level 18 and then 32. That's not too bad. God! Great. Yay! Aww! Alright. Um. Let's see where we're at here. You know, Weechi needs heal. But I press on! We're training, guys. We're training, okay? No pain, no gain. Ooh, a Badoo! Badoo! You think your sentient plant is better than my sentient plant? My sentient plant is a turtle! Worry seed? Oh, no. No, don't inhale it, Pop Cream! You'll get anxiety! Or insomnia! Well, anxiety can lead to insomnia. Proceed! Yes! But you... Aw, oh, man, I'm poisoned. See, this is why I picked up the antidote. Y'all laughed at me! Y'all laughed at me! Make sure you grind before the Elite Four. It is no joke. Like, all right, fair, fair point. We're uh, we're a while off, but we'll see. Why did no one heal Bullet? Because we really don't care. That's how it goes. Yes. Aww. All right. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? Something new? Oh, Starly. Sorry, Starly. I don't know what flyer we're gonna get in this game, but... Not gonna be you. Eh, I'll just run. It's a bird, bird, bird. It's a bird is the word. Yeah, a bird, bird, bird. It's a bird is the word. Alright, that was a pretty good training session. Murder the bird. I imagine, like, if Pokemon was, like, real. Like, the town, like, the, the grass in the starting towns would just be littered with dead Bidoofs and Starlies, like, as far as the eye can see. Not a fan of, uh, Starly. You know, it's not that I'm not a fan of Starly, it's just that I want something better. What are some other good flying types in this game? Alright, fine, I'll go to the school. Alright. What do we got? Ah, uh, hey, Roger, what's up? Now, I came here because no one else... Uh, no one would let, le let me leave the town unless I came and studied at, uh, you know, school first. So, here I am. It's kind of weird, though. Kids going to school in this universe? That's, that's really weird. <laughs> Give me a map. That's actually probably going to be useful here because I don't know much about Sinnoh. See you around! Alright, Roger. Nice. Alright, let's actually take a look at this map here. 
Oh, it's uh, actually has its own. That's cool. There we go. All right. So Sinnoh's obviously based on Hokkaido, northern Japan. So we got a very cold area up here. I would love to visit Hokkaido, by the way. Um. All right. We got Jubilife City. We got no no gyms yet, right? We haven't gone to any gyms yet. Um. Floroma Town. Kana 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 Lave City. All right. Oraburg. All right. Where where are we going? <laughs> you guys are gonna have to help me out a lot on this because I've never played this game before. I do not know the proper route. <laughs> you you both made your uh, each other's rivals cannon. Yep. Yes, we did. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go finish off those uh, other trainers. I did heal, right? Ah, oh, here we go. Guy with a mustache. Great. Auraburg. We're going to Auraburg. Okay. So you're a Pokemon trainer, young man. You don't have a Poketch yet. Well, you kids these days, you all need to have a Poketch. You don't catch Pokemon. Because it's a Poketch. Alright, I guess I have to go to the creepy clown guy. I have to go to Buggy. Hi, Buggy. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah. Does it have... Well, it depends. Does it have arms? Some Pokemon don't have arms. Yay, I got a coupon! Yay! Thank you, Buggy. Okay, cool. Ugh. Ugh. All right, I gotta find the clowns. Send in the clowns. Just like Pokemon, do the moves of Pokemon also have types? Oh my god. Ugh. Actually, no, I don't think they do. <laughs> Send in the clown. If they don't have any arms, you just duct tape the item to the Pokemon, yeah. Like, how does Spirit Tomb hold anything? Well, I guess he has spectral arms. How does a Ghastly hold anything? How do you. Ghastly is a gaseous being! How do you make him hold anything? Excuse me, lady, do you know where the clowns are? Excuse me. I need to find the clowns. I mean, I don't want to find the clowns, but I have to find the clowns. City of Joy. Oh, that's. Alright, that's a little bit. Okay. With flex tape, you fle that's it. Flex tape, it works even on gaseous bodies with no real mass. A paralyzed heal. Twins. All right, I'll talk to the twins. Oh. Actually, you know what? Fine, let's kill. That's a level six. That's a challenge. Level six is a challenge. Yeah. Gotta get leveled up at some point. It had to be clowns. Why did it have to be clowns? Have you guys ever been, like, afraid of clowns growing up? Remember a couple years ago when we had that clown scare? Like, everybody was dressing up as murderous clowns and, like, running around town, like, scaring the shit out of people? Yeah, then we had that cold snap, and that kill kind of killed them all off. That was a weird. That was a weird time. Your Ouija grew to level seven. Oh man, we're making good progress here. I remember there was a. Ooh, anything good? Nah. I remember there was uh, a birthday party I was invited to as a kid, and it said on the card that they were gonna have a clown there, and I wasn't like afraid of clowns. Because I never really encountered clowns before, I just didn't want to go. The idea of a clown just like freaked me out. Like I don't want to. I don't want to see a clown. So I've never actually been like had a fear of clowns, but I just didn't want to be around them. All right, there we go. Okay, I'm trading Pokemon with my buddy. Okay. Uh, where's the clown at? Is he like hidden back here? 
That'd be funny. He said by the twins. Is it the old man? Are you really a clown, old man? You gotta tell me! Yeah, it was in 2016. I remember when that happened, yeah. You passed it again. How am I passing it? Oh, there he is. Yeah, sure. So the answer to all the questions was just yes. Oh my god. Alright, cool, great, awesome. Now what do I do? I'm guessing I go over here. Oh, you can be sure I keep developing PokeH apps. Yes, the apps are certainly something. Alright, I guess I'm just going back to the guy then. Aw, oh, man, I think I kind of remember the Poketch from my, uh, Platinum Let's Play. And I wasn't a huge fan of it. Yay, we got our Poketch! By the way, stupid name. Probably not pronouncing it right, but, you know. Alright, cool. Yeah. I wonder if they'll make that in real life for us to use. Probably not. Remember the, uh... Oh, remember the, uh, the Poke, um... It was the freaking tracker thing. Not the tracker, although it might have been. I don't know. Um, the speedometer thing, like the odometer you would, uh, attach to your belt from Heart Gold Soul Silver. Remember that thing? I remember that thing. I still have it somewhere. Yeah. The Poke Walker. Yeah, that thing. The Poke Walker. That was probably my favorite Pokemon peripheral ever. Alright, here we go, Roger. First battle. Here we go. Love your hair, man. Style it. Alright, here we go. Oh, I got, I got that just the thing for you. Hot off the presses. Let's do it. What level is that, Starly? Level... something. Oh, quick attack, we're good. Ooh, eh, not bad. Ah, oh, level 7. Alright, we can do this. Go, Yoroichi! Ah, that's physical attack, but this is special, right? Right? Did I say it right? Did I do a thing? Yeah! Call down the thunder! It's actually lightning, so it should be called lightning shock, not thunder shock. Because, you see, thunder isn't actually an electric... Ah! Oh! All right, cool. Level eight, nice. Charge! Yes! Oh, yeah, what, this is great. A Chimchar, all right. Well, you know who we gotta do for this, that's right. God! Soften him up, God! God. You got two Poke Poke Walkers? That's crazy. Yeah, so when I was in, uh, I think junior year of high school, that's when my friend Casey was like, you gotta play the new Pokemon games. They're, you know, redone versions of Gold and Silver, and you get this Poke Walker with them, and that's, that's actually what got me back into the games. And I've been consistently playing them ever since then. Yeah, so it's been like, it was like a four-year period there from like 2006 to 2010, I didn't play anything Pokemon. All right, uh, we can lower this thing's attack do that. Alright, now weaken it. Attack a little bit. Alright, a little bit helps. Growl again. That's fine. All right, here we go. I wish I had a defense lowering move for God, but what am I gonna do? All right, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. All right, sorry, God. All right, here we go. Pop green, your time to shine. Oh, hey, everybody. Oh, thanks. Stay warm this Christmas. I don't know why I used a grass type move, because it's weak, right? But I'm also getting stabbed, so I guess it's something. 
Oh yeah, let's go on a shiny hunt after this. That won't take very long. Yeah, not very effective. Alright, here we go. He doesn't seem to know any fire moves yet, though, so that's reassuring. There it goes. This is the, uh, the region of scarves, I've noticed. Everybody likes to wear scarves in this. You have a water move? Well, it's just withdraw. Alright, one more of those should be good. Alright, there we go. Alright, Roger. I have faced your Chimchar in pitched combat. I lost? Oh, no, 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 no. You said you had 10 million. You give me. I want to see the 10 million. Oraberg Gym. Alright, let's go hit up the gym. Oh, we got some trainers on this path. Alright, alright, cool, cool. Uh, let me know whenever I'm going on a route if there's anything cool I can catch. What are the fossil Pokemon in this? Uh, we have Shieldon and Kranidos, right? Those are the, uh, the fossils. I could go for a Shieldon. Those are, those are pretty cool. If I have to choose, I'll go with that. Leafage! Ah, uh, you can get an Abra. Uh, yeah, I think we'll be stopping after Gym 1. Yeah, Roger, his Let's Play was like five parts, but I think he did like five, six hours for each one. Yeah, mine mine's not going to be like that. Yeah, I'll switch it out for a Zubat, sure. I get an Abra here. Alright, let's try to get an Abra. Shield on is Pearl. Oh, great, great, awesome. Well, I have Pearl, so let's let's get ourselves a Shield on. I didn't even know that. I don't think it can kill me, but I don't want to waste on charge. Do this. There we go. Paralyze. Damn it. Nah, it's not Thunder. Shook. Aw, oh, man. I could go for an Abra at this point in the game, definitely. The way we're leveling up to... Oh, no, you know, it looks like we have, like, an automatic EXP share, too. That's one of those other things that they included in the game that I'm just glad that it just it's a feature now. You don't have to, like, get it somewhere. All right, let's try to get an Abra. Abra, come out and play. No, Starly, no. Starly, down. Oh, I forgot to tell you, my mom uh, got a new dog. She got a new dog. Um, she is a boxer mix. Uh, she actually looks like a combination between our old dog, Lucky, and Duchess, who was a boxer. Uh, so it looks like a combination between a beagle and a boxer. And her name is Lucy. She named her Lucy. And she's very scared. She picked her up from the shelter uh, a couple of days ago. And uh, I haven't gotten a chance to see her yet, but she's... Uh, she looks like a very loving dog. It's just she has to get used to, you know, being in a new home and stuff. Yeah. Is it edible? The dog? Uh, yes, but uh, I don't think my mom's going to be eating the dog. Yeah. I'll probably get a dog, but it'll probably be next year after I get everything. And after we've been here for a few months, get everything hooked up, set up, and ready to go. All right. You should uh, go back and heal my Pokemon. Nah. I'm gonna follow the uh, the Gary Oak philosophy. Pokemon, they're, they're good on their own. Actually, Gary actually wasn't that big of a dick to his Pokemon. Gary actually cared about his Pokemon quite a bit. Okay, I'll be like generic uh, character of the day in Pokemon that's like, I don't care about my Pokemon. They can fight until they drop. Which is ironic, because that's pretty much how most people play these games. <laughs> and then at the end of the episode, Ash, Brock, and Misty have to be like, Pokemon aren't just for your own self, you know, worth. They're their own living things. <laughs> yep, 
Yes, I read the scans, but we're not talking about that today. In the south of Route 203, you can catch a Ralts. What's the, uh, what's the percentage chance to find an Abra here? Because if it's like a 1%, I'm not, I'm not gonna bother. Abra's cool, Cadaver's nice, but he's kind of glass cannon you know what I mean? I never like Pokemon. NEVER! I mean, yeah. I like it. It's like, it's like 10 to 5%. Alright. Five percent. Pretty high. I had a bunch. Abra! Damn it, Starly! I will electrocute every bird on this route if it means I can get an Abra. Yeah, all right. You'll get a shiny Abra. Next time I uh, do the uh, next episode, I gotta have my laptop with me to have, like, um, you know, Bulbapedia opened or whatever so I can just check the ratios and everything all myself. Yeah, I'm gonna try another patch of grass after this. I would like a Psychic at this point in the game. A, a Ralts would be great as well. Ralts. Um, you know. Oh, look, a Pokeball. Oh, I found a Pokeball that looked like a Pokeball, but it turned out to be a Pokeball. Did I fight you yet? Alright, let's try over here. Yeah, I'll battle you in a second, kid. Hold on. Right, let's see what we got. Ah, Starly. Yeah, start thinking of names for an Abra or a Ralts, I guess, yeah. Da, da. So, it's uh, finally starting to snow here today. Um, the snow is not really... Because I moved to a lower elevation, because my old town was basically at the top of a mountain. So I kind of moved to a lower elevation. So it still snows, but, like, where we get, like, three, four feet of snow up at uh, my old place, we'll get, like, you know, two, three inches here, which is... I'm fine with that. Um, oh, a cricket... A uh, cricket talk. Okay. Alright. Uh, but anyway, yeah, uh, so it's starting to snow today, and it's coming down a decent amount. I actually have to check after this to see if the snow is, like, sticking at all. But, uh, yeah, I like the snow, I just don't like it when it's like, yeah, you're gonna get two feet next, uh, next week. I'm like, oh, great, awesome. The car is gonna get buried, I have to go out and shovel all that. And I always had to park outside at my old place, so now I have a garage. I have a heated garage, damn it. I have a garage with a furnace in it, yeah. Damn straight. None of that de-icing three inches of ice off my car in the dead of January in minus five degree weather. No more! Struggle bug! Can you lower the game's volume? I wish I knew how. Like, I could try this. Wait, hold on. Let me try something really quick. I'm going to adjust the volume, the, the volume knob on my microphone. Giggity. Let me know if this actually adjusts the game volume. I don't feel like it should, but I can try it. La 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 la. La, 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 la. Was there any change there of note? Houdini sounds good for Abra. Abra was actually named after... His original Japanese name was Casey. C-A-S-I. Named after a magician from, like, the early 20th century, I think. No, that didn't do anything. All right, cool. All right, that's good, at least. Okay, so we've discovered game audio plays, even though I don't have game audio playing. And we've discovered this knob does not control game audio. Good. Learning. I could lower the game audio a bit, though. Alright, how about that? Where does that get us? Alright, come on! Give me something good other than a bird! Come on! I already have one of those! And she's going to be the best damn Shinx in the entire game. Change the speed, please. I can do that, too. Oh, check text speed while I'm at it. Yeah, that's good. good call. Good call. Good call. Okay, text speed. Go to... What, what, what style do you like, guys? 
Ooh, yellow. Ooh, yellow with stripes. Ooh, gray with stripes. Ooh, blue with stripes. Ooh, sequin. Ooh, these are really. Oh, oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, now we're talking. Now we're cooking with gas. Come on, damn it. I want to catch something good on this route. Oh yeah, now we're getting into one hit KO range. Now it's getting good. Ah, uh, you mean I gotta actually use the Poke, the Poke Watch thing in order to catch things? Uh, all right. Well, beggars can't be choosy, I suppose. All right, here we go. Last Caitlyn. She's got three, three Bidoofs! So are these trainers even trying? Or are they just hanging out by their towns, getting Pokemon, and just fighting with each other's Bidoofs and Starlies? Get out there! Journey! It's what it's all about. Oh yeah, God is still famous. I don't know, I might do the I might do the beauty contest, who knows? It's a whole new world with a whole new attitude. See, now we're streaming fine, because I had the, uh, at least, okay, I know that works, okay. When I do regular live streams, it's relatively okay. It still crashes sometimes, but it's not that bad. Uh, but I think when I do video games, when I do streaming, I need to hook up this, um, Cat6 cable. So I have to everybody a cookie. As soon as I say that, drop frames detected. I think it might have been because I touched the cable. You know what? I'm not even touching the cable. I'm not touching it. I have bad luck with internet. Alright. I think I've been using leafage on this thing so long. <clears throat> yeah. It was a loop. It's a loop! I'm gonna make spaghetti after this tonight. Got some garlic. I'm gonna make some homemade garlic bread. Gonna make some spaghetti. Alright, come on. Something good. Damn it. Jirachi is acquired in Flower Town. Eh, Jirachi's not that good. What do you think is the lamest legendary Pokemon? Lamest legendary. No, we didn't have Thanksgiving. Well, we went to go see my grandfather yesterday. He's in a home. Uh, so we didn't really have turkey or anything yesterday. I have a turkey in my freezer. Um, but I think I'm just going to save that for Christmas and I'll cook it at Christmas time. Heatran, Fione. You know, I never cared for Moltres. I got to be honest. I thought even when I was a kid, I think Moltres was kind of boring. Moltres was just like a fire bird. And I was just like, eh. Ah, oh man, I thought that was an Abra. It was like small. I'm thinking, well, it's not a Starly and it's not a Shinx. <laughs> Tornadus is cool. I like Tornadus. Hoopa. I'm all right with Hoopa. <gasps> oh shit. Okay. All right. Whoa. All right. All hands on deck. Okay. <laughs> All right, we are not going to try to catch this guy again, so this is our one shot. All right. All right, everybody. Shh, shh, quiet. Everybody quiet. Everybody shut up, okay? You don't want to scare it, all right? In the wild, Abras are extremely, extremely pensive in meditation. They will teleport away if sensed and disturbed. All right. All right. Hold. Hold. Ready? Not yet. Not yet. Wait for it. Go! Hold B. Huh? 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 Aha! Yeah! We did it! All right. Not bad. 
Yeah, we need quick balls now. Yeah. Meow. All right, we got a female. Oh, they don't have gender. Okay, cool. Well, they don't have a specific gender. Okay. Um. Even while asleep, it maintains a telepathic radar. Oh, I know. Is that just the Pokedex entry, or is this actually? Hold on. It's a male. It's a male Abra. Male Abra. I was gonna say. I'm pretty sure. Okay, Houdini. Let's go with Houdini then. All right. Yeah, Houdini's good. Who done it? Houdini done it. <laughs> Serial killer. All right, is there anything extra I can add here? Can't add little icons, can I? Little emojis. Nah. All right. Houdini! <laughs> Did you just assume it's gender? Yeah, I misread. I misinterpreted. I, I apologize. Alright, cool. Now we can get a Ralts too. Oh, that'd be sweet. Alright, alright, we caught an Abra. Alright, cool. Now we're prepared to take on the gym. Actually, I'm gonna kill this Bidoof to see if I can get some levels up for the, uh, the Abra. Alright, that was good. That was good. There we go, level four. Not bad. Hey, check it out. I got an Abra. Do you have one? I bet not. Starlies! Getting real tired of seeing Badoop Starlies and Shinxes, guys. Just gotta say. I can move my mic back a bit. That might help. How about that? New mic, new studio. Gotta get used to everything. Oh man, I'm actually in danger of dying here. But my Pokemon will be okay, because I push them to the limit. Yeah, Manaphy and Fiona aren't that cool. Houdini's level 5, nice. You know what? No. He's gonna fight. He's a damn winner, that's why. He's a winner. Yeah! There we go. Huh, direct audio from the Switch itself. Okay. Not used to... I'm not used to streaming with the Elgato. I did that Castlevania stream a couple weeks ago, but the audio input was different with that. I didn't have to adjust the game audio on that one, which was weird. But hey, it's different. Or maybe it was just set up perfectly. I don't know. Didn't need to. All right. You got this. Because I believe... Wow, Machop looks way bigger than... Yeah! Yeah! He's a champion! What did I tell you? Pop Green's a champion! He's going to the top! Take that, Sebastian. Oh, no! I'm going to go be a butler for a rich baron in England. Okay. Alright. Where are we? Oh, do we have to go through a cave to get here? Ah, lovely. Alright. In the cave. Yes, old man? Hmm. Ah, cool. We got some TM-98s. Nice. That's a nice little beat. Nice. Alright, well, I wonder who we're gonna teach that to. God. Oh, so they only give you three of them. Well, I guess that's more than one. Less than infinite, though. Ah, oh, great. I kind of just want to get out of this uh, cave and just get to the city. It's all right. Camper Curtis. This is dangerous. This is like a mine shaft, kid. Why three? You don't need it. Well, God has it now.
Yeah, there's a reason they made HMs obsolete. Yeah. I mean, that was that was one of the most annoying parts of the games, honestly, that you had to care. You had to either teach them to Pokemon that you didn't want them to have, like like Pokemon that you actually used, or you had to carry around an HM slave to do everything for you. I'm glad they just changed them to items, or you could do them out of battle. I mean, that's that's the best way to do that, yeah. Well, at least we have a fighting move that really sucks, but yeah. Badoo! The mind just collapses when we're using Rock Smash in here. Yeah. Why do I keep using Leafage on these things? Eh. Wow, Pop Green is really... He, he's really pulling his weight here. Pop Green is a champ. Champion! Abolish HM slavery. Well, they did. They pretty much did. Not until Gen... What was it? Gen 7 they did that, though? I think it was Gen 7. Oh, Psyduck. Yeah, no, Psyduck. Yeah, we're strong against Psyduck. Psyduck! Psy! He's on Cloud 9. That is a very happy Psyduck. Try to be happy after this! Oh, yeah! There we go. Bigger face cam? Uh, I can zoom in. Maybe next time when I do it, I'll, I'll zoom in. Because we're, we're kind of almost done here now. I'm gonna review the new One Piece chapter um, when the official comes out on Sunday. Uh, like the last ones I've done for like a year or so. It's a good chapter though. I'm really excited to talk about it. I don't want to say more though. Alright, we made it! Yay! Howdy, trainer! You don't have a single gym badge, aren't you, I reckon? Other trainers will look down on you if you're not a total noob, right? <laughs> I love how they put that in here. So I'll show you where the town's Pokemon gym is. Come on there, partner, come on. Welcome to Texas. <laughs> Welcome to the Old West. Ah, oh, there's someone there. Tarnation. Hey, Roger. Oh, God. It's gonna be one of those. Can't these gym leaders just stay in their damn gyms? Every time something happens in the town, they have... Do these towns not have police? Do these towns not have mayors? Gym leaders gotta do everything around here. Sorry, sir. We can't, uh, there's no bankers at the bank because the bankers have to go and solve a gang war that's going on the other side of town. There's no one else to handle it. <laughs> Alright. Where am I going? Where's the mine at? The gym leaders are the police! <laughs> okay. I don't know what way I'm supposed to go here. You sound like that old man from Gravity Falls. Stan, yeah. You're my favorite YouTuber. Thank you, Gabrielle. South of the city. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, shit. Yeah, this looks like a safe place for a kid. Just wander into a mine. Yeah, he's down in the mines, probably. X-Defense. I will probably never use this. Sounds like a remix of Mountain Moon. Uh, so does anybody want to give me a hard hat? Uh, you know, this is a bunch of, uh, viola like, HIPAA violations down there. OSHA. Is it HIPAA or OSHA? I think HIPAA is, like, the health service. OSHA, right? It would be OSHA. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Rock meat grass. There's no leaves down here to throw, though. So, right, I brought my own. Ooh, shit. Oh, does he have sturdy? Yeah, he has sturdy, yeah. You can polish your rocks all you want, Geodude. Yeah, that'd be Osha. The next Pokemon we catch down here should be named Osha. Osha is worker safety. HIPAA is patient privacy. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. You mix up all the acronyms every now and then, you know? Alright. We gotta catch a Pokemon down here. We gotta we gotta name it. We gotta name it Osha. Oh, that was down here. I thought that was a trainer. Oh, okay, cool. All right. Is it... Okay, is it just Geodudes down here, or... Can we catch something actually cool? Machop be Osha. 
Osha sounds like a girl's name. Oh, but it's a female Geodude! Alright. Alright, let's rock with that. If it has Sturdy, why not? Alright, let's do it. Oh, let's do... Let's do this. Sturdy! Oh, shit! Okay, I guess that one didn't have Sturdy! Okay! Osha the Onyx! Oh, they can find an Onyx down here! Alright. No, an Onyx. An Onyx would be better. Okay, okay, okay. Let's do Onyx. Let's find an Onyx and name her Osha. We get a female Onyx. Osha. That reminds me, wasn't there a character, um... Please be an Onyx. Damn it! Okay. Um, Game of Thrones. The wildling that helped out Brandon Stark and Hodor that, uh, helped them get to the north. Uh, what was her name? Because I feel like it sounded... It was like Osha. It sounded similar. It was something like that. Osha's not a joke. No, it's not a joke, but apparently these guys think it's a joke. Look, there's a little girl running around down here with no damn head protection! She's like five! <laughs> Osha is a joke. <laughs> At what point does Bleach get good? I'd say if you're watching the Soul Society arc and you're not, like, into it by then, then you're probably not gonna be into it ever. Like, some people just don't like the series, and that's fine. But I would say, if you're if you're getting to the point where, like, watch to the end of the Soul Society, I'd say. Watch to, like, episode 60. If you're not into it by then, then you're probably never going to be. That was... that. It was Osha. That was her name. Was it? Oh, wow. It was... Yeah, okay. Alright, let's try to find a, an Onyx down here, then. Is the onyx deeper in the cave, though? Well, let's keep going. Let's just keep going and continuing the plot. And maybe we'll run across an onyx along, along the way. It was Osha. All right, cool. Yeah, their storyline was a joke. I mean, I never cared for the brand storyline. Like, even when it followed the plot of the, of the book... Like, him becoming a warg and, like, seeing, like, the third eye and becoming the, the, the third-eyed raven. Even when it was that plot, I didn't like it. I, I didn't like that, 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 um, that plot. Never cared for it. Yep. Let's bring your daughter to work day. Worker Mason. Ah, I love his goatee, man. Alright, I'm on the job down here in this brutal mine, but I can take time out of my day to Pokemon battle a ten-year-old. Let's do it. boss is gonna have my ass if I don't get this done, but whatever, sure, we can stop to do this. Yeah, if you don't, if you're watching that Ichigo versus Byakuya fight, when Ichigo goes Bankai, Byakuya's going into Senpon Zakura Kageyoshi, like, if you're watching that shit, and you're just not feeling it, then, yeah, Bleach isn't for you. And that's not a bad thing, that's just saying that, like, it's just not for you, you know? There's lots of series I've watched that people love, and I just never got into it. Onyx is 10%. Alright, well, that's not too bad. Catch an Onyx. Onyx would be cool. I don't have a... Ooh, yes! Oh, okay. Uh, Razor Leaf. Uh, what do you guys think? Uh, Razor Leaf. Just 55, 95. Just get rid of Tackle, I guess. Okay, is Growth gonna be... Well, Attack and Special Attack. I think I should keep Growth. 40, 100. 55, 95. Maybe I should just replace the Leafage. Nah, I don't want to get rid of Withdrawal. Yeah, but Growth increases your attack and special attack. Isn't that good? I'm getting rid of Tackle. We're going to spend two hours fighting Geodudes. If that's what must happen, that is what must happen. Alright. Okay, Mason. Hey, uh, you see an Onyx around here, man. Yes, I do. What if I don't... See, this is this is the fundamental difference on why I am not a professional Pokemon player. He's like, well, you don't need two grass moves. It's like, yeah, because sometimes I want to mix it up. <laughs> sometimes I want to use a different battle animation. <laughs> well, I wouldn't throw Turtwig out against a fire type. Uh, who am I kidding? I totally would. 
Hey man, you look cool. I like your hair. Okay, stand back. Watch this, kid. Watch this shit. Boom! I just punched that rock with my bare fist! Of course, you'd have to beat the gym leader. That'd be me! Oh, cool, so we could just fight right now, right? Okay, or you can run off. That's great, awesome. Escape rope! Alright. I respect that, to be honest. Alright, come on, Onyx. I think it looks like we're kind of at the end of the cavern here. I can't really go any deeper than this. So... Come on, Onyx. Come on, Onyx. No! Get you! So how does Geodude float? Is it like magnets or, um... Eh? Well, it's... It's it's in Poke Dollars, so $659 is like 7 bucks. Magic. Alright. Just as long as there was an explanation now. Magic. Alright, I'm cool with that. It is magic. It is magnetism, I think. Yeah. Geodude. It's sheer power and it's rage. Yeah, I love some of the explanations they give in Pokedex entries. It's great. Geodude runs on the sheer manliness of his arms. Like, ah, cool, nice. It's a mystery rock. Yeah, that's how Luffy would say it. Eh, it's a mystery rock. It floats. Whatever. Geodude is actually psychic rock. Ah. Matt is too tone deaf to be in any rest of his songs. No, that's true. There was a while there where he was thinking about, I think, a few of us being in a cypher. Uh, but then he was like, you know what? I'm just going to keep professional rappers in my songs and that's it. And I'm like, you know what? That's fair. That's fair. Because you don't want to hear me, like, y you know, I've, I've tried. I've actually tried. I've, um, there was one video where I thought I was going to sing, a I was going to play a song, but I didn't want to, ooh, a Zubat, that's different. But I didn't want to, uh, play the song on the actual video because copyright. So I'm like, oh, I'll just sing it. So I was singing the song, and no matter how I sang it, no matter what I did, every time I played it back, it just sounded like shit. And I'm like, oh, screw this then. Yeah, good call on Rustage's part. No, no, he was 100% right, yeah. So he's gonna come visit in a couple of weeks. Uh, so TechoCon is being held in Pittsburgh. Uh, they usually held, hold it in April, but uh, at the beginning of April, but because of COVID, they didn't have it in 2020, and it got bumped back this year until December, because that's just when they could have it. And so, uh, Rustage is coming in, and we're gonna go to the con together, and we're gonna hang out there for a little while, and then he's gonna come back here, and we're gonna do some videos and stuff together. Um, you know, we can do, I don't know if D&D, &D, D D's that week, but I think it's the, uh, day before we leave, so I think we'll get D&D &D done before he shows up. But I think the following week we have to do Isekai D&D &D here. Yeah. I will not sing. But, I'll have him, so, you know, if I want to do a video and have him sing in the background, then yeah, I could do that. I'll just be like, hey, Rustage, come in here and sing a song, because I suck at it. So that, that should be fun, though. Da -da! Okay, you guys are sure there's an Onyx in here, right? I believe you, I'm just saying. Yeah, the name of the con is Teko, and my name is Teking, completely unrelated. Actually, Teko was first. It started as Teko Show Con in, I think, 2006, and I created the name Teking in 2007. So, I, I think Teko was actually first. And the reason it's Teko is because uh, Tekken can mean iron, and, uh, and Teko Show, I think, is like ironworks or something in Japanese, and Pittsburgh, the city it's held in, um, is in the Rust Belt. Like, it used to be a big steel manufacturing uh, city during the, um, the 1800s and the 1900s and the Industrial Revolution and shit. So that's, that's the name. Onyx is a rare encounter here, 2%. Well, we're, we're kind of already committed at this point, so... All right, what time is it? It is 5.06. All right, I'll keep looking for nine minutes, all right? If it's 5.15 and we still don't have an Onyx, I'm just gonna go fight, um, what was his name, Granite or something? I'm gonna go fight Granite, and then we'll, uh, we'll call, uh, we'll call it part one. Been streaming for about, uh, well, 23 minutes because it had to stop and restart. But I think we've been going for like an hour, and maybe two hours at this point. No, it couldn't have been two hours. I think I started streaming around four. Wait. 
Wait, no, I think I started streaming around 3. Yeah, it, it's probably close to 2 hours at this point, yeah. I mean, I'd like to get a Steelix at some point. I could always trade with somebody. I could trade with Roger. Yeah, it's easier to trade Pokemon than it was back in the day. Remember, okay, was I the only lonely kid that didn't have anybody to trade with, so I had all my Pokemon and I couldn't get anything else? Because that was me when I was growing up. I had my Poke I had my Game Boy Color and I didn't have any didn't have anybody to trade with. Uh, it's different now. It's different now. Later on, you can catch the Steelix. Oh, that's that's a lot of fun. None of your classmates had Pokemon. Well, my classmates all played Pokemon, but you weren't allowed to bring your Game Boy Colors to school. And the town I lived in was kind of the town that wasn't like where most people lived. So that was the problem. I didn't live in the main town where like all the other p kids from school lived. I lived in like a village like 20 minutes away. And there wasn't that many people there that had Pokemon. And I didn't have any siblings either, so... Eh. It's alright, it all worked out. You know what? I'm gonna catch this Zubit. This Zubat, uh, just because they seem to be kinda rare down here. And, I mean, a Crobat at some point would be nice. Damn it, if only I knew Tackle. Actually, it's not very effective, so this shouldn't kill it. Ah, oh, now we're good. I'll catch a Zubat just to have. Oh no, he's being astonished. Yeah, I could get a Star Raptor. Oh wait, no, that's Starly's evolved form. Nope, we're not doing it. I should get a Crobat. We should all get a Crobat. If I get a Crobat, I want to name him Nightwing. Pokeball, go! <laughs> Come on. A little more. Yeah! Alright, nice. Yeah, Brobat is a good name. Is it a, is it a guy? Yes. Go with Brobat. Bruh. Brobat. Actually, what capital letter here? Bro bad. That's how it is. Alright. Ukyora Shifa. Do, 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 do. Come on. I have one more slot, don't I? Yeah, I have one more slot, and it's gonna be an Onyx. Alright, so we got a grass type, we got a flying poison type, we got a electric type, we got a normal type, we got a psychic type. Yeah, we're not doing bad. I should really be KOing these Geodudes. Like, if I actually do that, I will be leveling up even faster. If we got grass, like, boom. Well, some of them might have sturdy, so that's the... Aw, oh, shit! Now yeah, we're fine. Some of them might have sturdy. That's the only thing. Do you like mud kips? Briggs already used Brobat. Damn it! Why didn't you tell me? I'm sorry, Briggs! I'm sorry! Well, now I can't use the Zubat. Yeah, Kozaboro is Queen is Grandpa. Yeah, we already knew that. That was already revealed a while ago. That was revealed in an SBS like two volumes ago. Get with the times! It's gonna be a. Okay, it's, it's gonna be. It's 510. Got five more minutes. I have a feeling it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. I think I like the unofficial games Nuzlocke's more. Yeah, I like. I mean, to this day, and I've said this before, Pokemon uh, Prism was the f most fun I've ever had doing a Nuzlocke. With Briar, the sexy vampire, and the customizable options, and the Gen 2 sprites. I mean, they, the Power Rangers you fight, like, damn, I love that game. The game was awesome. Yeah, you can change the names anyway. Well, it's a good thing. Houdini's getting up there. Level 10, good. Uh, level 16, right? That's when Abra evolves into Kadabra? I get it, Abracadabra. I get it. Kadabra. Catch more subways. <laughs> oh man, I can't wait until it's unexpected arrival.
Catch more Zubats! We demand more Zubats! The Gibble. Oh yeah, Gibble. We need to catch a Gibble. Please tell me it's easy to catch a Gibble at some point. We're not going to stand a chance against Cynthia without a Gibble. And yeah, there's another Zubat. I can't bay leaf that joke. <laughs> I really want a Rotom. Rotom's in, like, the uh, the ghost house, isn't it? I want to find the Rotom. Rotom is awesome. What mode of Rotom do you think we want to roll with? Oh, maybe that should be our water type. Washing machine Rotom. Use Togekiss against Cynthia. You need a Togekiss for Cynthia without Megas. Why do you need a Togekiss? Why? Is there something Togekiss can do that no other Pokemon in this entire game can do? I doubt that! Rotom is post-game. Shit. Alright. Come on, Onyx. Now, here's the problem, though. If we run into a fucking Onyx, we have to catch it. Because this, this is a process. Rotom Wash is Electric Ghost. Ah, that sucks. Wait, no, it isn't. I thought Rotom. Wa I thought Rotom as default was Electric Ghost. Because what's the point of having the oven and the stove? I mean, the oven and the fridge and the uh, the, and the fan if it's the same type each time. Excuse me, sir. Have you seen an Onyx in these parts? Yeah, I was gonna say Rotom is Electric Water. There we go. Nah. Nah. I want an Onyx now. I know there I know there's other opportunities in the game to find them. Onyx isn't like a super rare Pokemon or anything. But I can catch one now. The early part of the game. And then the plan will come together. Ooh, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it's pretty hard not to find an Onyx consider You know, that was one of my favorite things when I was watching Pokemon as a kid, like so many times the gang gets kidnapped by Team Rocket, right? And they get thrown in like a cage or some shit. And it's like, Brock, you literally have access to like a 500 pound giant rock snake. It's just like, Onyx should be able to break out of like any cage, anything. Like, it's giant. I put my Rotom inside the God Machine and it became Divine Beast Electric. Crossing into Yu-Gi-Oh typing now. Let me try something here. Is this a smashable rock? I guess not. Oh, here we go. Yes! Yes! How unexpected of you! Alright guys, we can't fuck this up. Alright. We can't mess this up. Ugh. Alright. Ugh. That was perfect. Right at 515 too. Right at 515. Alright. Oh, it's a female too. The OSHA joke's actually gonna work. Alright. What abilities could Onyx have? If Onyx could have... I don't think this will be a one-hit kill. I would use Leafage. I wouldn't use Razor Leaf. Go for it! Ow. I'm a high ruler. <laughs> you lucky son of a bitch. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna use a heal ball on it too because I love you, Onyx. I love you. I love you. Alright, alright, alright. It's fine. It's cool. Alright. Oh man, Ron Onyx is using the Smackdown. Ooh. Oh man, Onyx is. Onyx is messed up. He's, he's really hurting uh, Pop Green here. Alright, here we go. 
And it has sturdy lady. Oh, damn. Oh, man, this thing is... This thing is... Uh, okay, all right then. Okay. Ow. Pop green! No! Well, if this was a Nuzlocke, we'd be screwed right now. Uh... Oh, shit. Hmm. Okay, well, let's uh, be glad that Pop Green pulled in uh, its weight there, ladies and gentlemen. Because otherwise, we'd be really screwed. I just throw a Pokeball this thing. Come on! Level 9, down to 1 HP. Let's go! Oh my god. Yeah, I might be able to take at least two more of those. Come on! Come on. Good. Damn it! Alright, fine. Yeah, use Bide. What about Bide, huh? What about Bide? Remember Bide? I like Bide. It's a good move. Spend two turns doing nothing. It was a good time. Come on. Get in the ball! Damn it! This is... Look. Onyx, there is a joke that I made. I have to carry it out, alright? Alright. All right, let's think this through logically here. Okay. I throw this Pokeball. If it doesn't get caught on this turn, Bidoof's gonna die. All right, so. Bidoof's gonna die. I could throw in Yoruichi. Is Smackdown... Is Smackdown a, um, rock move? And wait, wait. I don't think rock is super effective against electric. And Yoruichi's pretty high level. I think Yoruichi might be okay. All right, I'm going with it. I've been taking risks up until now. What's another one, right? Pokeball, go! Hold B! Spam B! It didn't work! Alright, so he's gonna rock polish. Oh, wait. Oh, but the bind's gonna kill it. Right, okay, cool. Great, awesome. I can potion Zubat. Yeah, I could. This is all for a joke. This is all for a stupid joke I told when I walked into the damn mine. Hold B! Hold it! Press it as hard as you can! Oh, thank God! Alright! We did it, guys! High five! There we go. Alright. Uh, all for the sake of a joke. But damn it, it was worth it. Oh, what are we doing? Oh, bites? Yeah. Uh, sure. Get rid of... Mm. Yeah, get rid of Leer. Okay. Ooh, Yoroichi learns how to bite. There we go. Okay, and it's a female Onyx. I couldn't ask for more for the sake of this joke. Ugh. 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 There. There we go. The joke has been- the prophecy has been fulfilled, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Alright, let's get the hell out of here now. Watch, we run into another Onyx on the way out. Alright, good. Alright, alright, okay, cool, cool, cool. Alright, let's go defeat Rourke, and uh, let's call it an episode. Oh, the sun's going down. Nice. Uh, no, just because Roger was playing Brilliant Diamond, so I decided to play Shining Pearl. That's the only reason, really. Also, when I went to go to the store to buy it, uh, they were actually out of Brilliant Diamond. Like, I'd already made up my mind I was gonna buy Pearl, but when I went to the store, they didn't have Diamond, and I was like, oh, okay, well that makes my decision easy for me then. We can all sleep tonight now. Alright, here we go. All right, Pop Green's gonna lead. Yeah, I think we'll be all right. Let's check on our Pokemon. Let's check on our Pokemon and see what we got working with here. Okay, we got Osha, the Onyx. Uh, her ability is, of course, Sturdy. Uh, we got Brobat, who's got Inner Focus. We got um, Abra, who also has Inner Focus. We have uh, Yoroichi, who has Rivalry. Becomes a competitive and deals more damage to Pokemon of the same gender, but deals less to Pokemon of the opposite gender. 
Alright, that... Um... Unaware? Tia God is unaware. And overgrow. Okay, nice. Alright, let's do it. Oh, man, this is so epic. Hey, Rorik, how you doing, buddy? I kind of just want to skip over. Can I just... Can I just... Can I just skip over these kids? Yeah, that was great. Okay, cool. Rorik, let's go! I spent, like, 20 minutes looking for that onyx in that mine. We're doing this. You and me. Let's go. Oh, man, he's so cool. He's like... Okay, he's like a J-pop singer... But his his motif is he's a miner. He's like he's wearing like mining gear, you know. Yeah, that's his like that's his thing, you know. All right, let's end it. I don't think this is gonna be a tough battle. Oh, it looks like you did not catch the one that had sturdy. There we go. Oh yeah. Rollout is a better defense curl. I thought Rorik was a girl. Oh, I always... I'm pretty sure he's a guy. Yeah. Should we do an Osha versus Onyx fight? You know what? Let's do it. Just that. Let's see what you got, Osha. Let's see what you got! Rollout has its power doubled by Defense Curl. Great, well... Alright, let's do it. Let's move super fast first. Yeah! Let's get fast as hell. Yeah! Oh, Stealth Rock? That means nothing to me. Because this is a... This is a death match that you're in. Okay. They're moving in synchron uh, synchronized like movements here. Ha! Nothing. Oh, that was a crit too. All right. Let's bring that smack down. Boom! Yeah. All right. We might have to rethink this. Damn it! Quit dropping rocks on my- at least let me drop rocks on your head! Ugh. All right. This might have, uh... This, this might have been a counterintuitive to what I really wanted here. Aha, there we go. Fear the giant rubber bands. Nah, I'm gonna switch out. Yeah, you, you did good, Osha. You did good, Osha. Uh, you, you did good, alright. I'm glad you're part of the team, Osha. Yeah, I know. Wow, Stealth Rock really does take a... Damn. Ow. Douche. <gasps> 20 minutes to, to find it, 20 minutes to win the battle. Or not! All right, there it goes. And just like Brock before you, you didn't have a chance, Rourke. You didn't have a chance. Oh, you have one more. Oh, man, I thought, okay. All right, all right, cool, cool. Yeah, I can't see it now. He's like a J-pop singer. All right. I'm not a fan of Kranidos anyway. I mean, he's all right. It's actually, Kranidos is actually based off of a uh, Pachycephalosaurus, which, of course, is Ulti's uh, dinosaur in One Piece. Yeah, all right, all right. You just keep keep flashing me that smile. See what happens. Of course. Yeah, it's not going to help you. Do it! There we go. All right. He's got a dinosaur! Alright! God! Through to level 10.
Yoroichi level 13. Houdini level 12. Nice, nice. All right, cool. All right, Rourke. What? I better pose with my glasses. All right, cool. Well, I'm glad your concert goes well. Ooh, that's nice. Thank you. The cool badge. Is it the cool badge or the coal badge? No, it's the coal badge. I'm like, oh, all right, that's significantly less cool. All right, TM76s. Okay, thanks. I've obtained some stickers that he had lying around in his junk drawer. Okay, thank you, Rourke. What was uh, what was the one he gave us? He gave us um, Stealth Rock. Oh, I mean, that's not a bad move. I mean, Stealth Rock is, is pretty good. Pop Green can learn it. All right, so we did it, ladies and gentlemen. We, let me save. Oh, does it automatically? Oh, there it goes. Yeah, we can save. All right, save my adventure, yes. All right, save my adventure, nice. All right. Well, that was fun. There's some stickers that look like rocks, yeah. Okay, well, huh. that was a good first episode, aside from, you know, all of the technical difficulties at the beginning, but, you know, I think we think we figured it out. I think we'll be all right moving forward, probably, yeah. Um, yeah, we got an Abra, and we uh, spent 20 minutes looking for an Onyx, but I think it was worth it. All right. So, I'm gonna get going here. I do not know when the next episode will be out. I don't know when the... I, this won't be a regular, like, you know, every Friday, every Saturday kind of thing. Uh, tomorrow, I'm actually gonna do... I was Well, I was gonna do a stream tomorrow, but I think I wanna do a video tomorrow instead, and then Sunday will be the One Piece review. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll try to do it once a week. Like, that'll be the uh, basic idea. Uh, and so that'll be the general idea there, but I have no idea how long it'll take me to beat this game. All right, um, anyway, yeah, slow and steady wins the race, I suppose. Nice and steady. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Hopefully things will run a little smoother next time. Uh, this will be Teching, signing out. Have a good one, everyone.